Francisco Pascual heads the local office of the Institutional Revolutionary Party in Atlacomulco, the hometown of Mexico's incoming president, Enrique Peña Nieto. He met Peña Nieto 30 years ago, when they were both starting out in the PRI. At the time, the PRI ruled Mexico as a virtual one-party state, and already had a long history of corruption and authoritarianism. Pascual says Peña Nieto represents something new for the PRI, and for Mexico. He combines experience with new images in a new framework. He's shown an ability to combine these both and balance them. And he represents a new generation. Peña Nieto made his name as governor of the state of Mexico, a position four other members of his extended family held before him. Peña Nieto laid the groundwork for his political career here, working his way up through the PRI and he benefited from strong ties to a political group known more for its backroom deals and old-style strong-arm politics than for any reformist tendencies. One of them was Arturo Mantiel, Peña Nieto's uncle and political godfather. Peña Nieto dedicated his 1991 university thesis to Montiel. In 2006, Montiel, then a candidate for president, dropped out of the race amid allegations his family had grown rich through millions of dollars in payoffs. He was never charged in the case. Peña Nieto says he should be judged on his record and not on his party's past. But one of Mexico's most respected historians is skeptical Peña Nieto can shake off the PRI's legacy. There is a fear about a political party with this kind of biography. Theorists tell us a political party never deviates from its starting point, and the starting point of the PRI isn't democratic. Many we spoke to in Atlacomulco noted the baggage the PRI carries as it returns to power. The PRI was bad in the past, and that bad image has stuck with it. But Peña Nieto has been renewing the image a bit. The party has changed regarding corruption. It's a little more transparent now. Now that he's taking office, we have to see how he works. We can't really say how he'll be until we see how he performs. As Peña Nieto leads the PRI back to power, millions of Mexicans will be watching to see if his government is a return to the past or a break from it. Adam Rainey, Al Jazeera, Atlacomulco, Mexico.